sun rays torching metal sheet roofs, turning shelters into ovens. Environmental advocates say, like most of Western India, Ahmedabad is reeling from the effects of climate change. Climate change will make things inconvenient for the rich. The poor will die. That doesn't have to be the case because there are low-cost solutions. Anjali Jaiswal is the senior director of the India Initiative at the Natural Resources Defense Council, or the NRDC. She explains how lethal the summer of 2010 was for the Shardabin Hospital in Ahmedabad. There was a devastating heat wave. Temperature spiked up to 46 degrees um, centigrade, uh, 116 Fahrenheit, and the hospitals were inundated. And that inside were oven-like conditions and resulted to death of infants, of babies during that time. More than 1,300 lives were claimed during that fatal heat wave. And the city of Ahmedabad said, enough is enough. Dalip Mavalankar is one of the key architects of the pioneering Heat Action Plan, the city's ongoing effort to reduce heat-related deaths. A vital part of that plan is the cool roof concept. We, with help of NRDC, developed and learned from other cities and places that how buildings can be modified. Like modifying the Shardabin Hospital's black tar roof to this white reflective mosaic roof. Jace Wall says that these roofs are making a huge difference by reflecting as much as 80% of the sunlight. And for people like Minabin Sani, the solution came from Mod Roof, a weatherproof panel made from recycled materials. Before, when we had a tin roof, it was very difficult. During the summer season, there were health problems. My husband would have trouble breathing. Now, after we installed the roof, it's cooler, and my husband can rest easily. Whether it's a low-cost modification or the installation of a new structure, simple solutions with the potential to save lives, protecting those most vulnerable from the harmful effects of climate change. Matt Rivers, CNN.